Torres. What's up, boo? Gang, what's up, baby? Wish poppin'. Did you miss me? Because I miss your motherfucking ass. Listen. Hey, boo, hey, if this is your first time to my channel, I'm Mocha. Also, if this is your first time to my channel, listen, I cuss, okay? Make cuss a little, make cuss a lot, just depending on... How the hell, what the hell this lick reading is reading, all right? So if cussing does not work for you, please feel free right down now to go find another reader here on YouTube that can further assist you without cussing. Because the way I'm set up, uh, this is my shit. I'm cussing, all right? Thank you for the likes, the shares, the subscribes, the comments, the patience, the love, the support, the donations, you guys, the readings, you all. Thank you so much just for just truly supporting me. I humbly appreciate that, my babies, from the most humblest space ever, all right? Also, if you need a personal reading, that information will be found within the description box below, all right? If you're new to the family, <laughs> hey, boo, welcome to the family, y'all. We a little this motherfucking functional around here, okay? All right, we don't fight and fuss, however, okay? We don't fight and fuss. We leave that shit on other people's channel, okay? But we do cuss. We share. We grow. We love. We enlighten. We evolve. Positive vibes only. Positive teens only, okay? All right. So this will be your... Uh, Monthly read for the month of March 2021, all right? Happy motherfucking New Year, Taurus. I know y'all mad at me. Listen. This is my story for 2004, and I ain't gonna mess up no more this year, okay? I'm an Aries, so y'all know I'm full of shit. Listen, if you don't know, if you don't know me by now, you will never, never, never know. I do what I want, okay? I do as I'm guided to do, all right? I don't I don't show up like everybody else, all right? I come when I'm in, when I'm instructed to. And I was actually sitting here in in my bed, all right? I was structuring my tasks, getting my readings together, Taurus. Y'all was screaming at me. So here here I am, all right? So, without further ado, this message will resonate with Sun, Moon, Rise, and Venus, the Cross Watchers, okay? Um, as well as the North Node in Taurus, all right? You guys, we're doing things a little bit differently today, okay? We're trying something new. Um, I did, um, well, I was advised to not just solely um, depend on the damn tarot cards, just completely kind of back away from tarot a little bit. So we're doing something a little different, all right? It's going to be just like it would normally be with the intuitive messages. However, these videos are going to be motherfucking shorter and we're working smarter, not harder, all right? Some of these videos will have an intro. Some of them will not. We got to get this We got to get this show on the road, Jack, all right? So off the rip, what I picked up with you, Taurus, is honey for uh, the month of March. Listen, Taurus, somebody bad for motherfucking business. And you know that this person is bad for business. However, you keep this person around. For some of you all, there's a fear of being by yourself, okay? Or someone around you has a codependency to you. And this person is um, has a fear of being by themselves as well, all right? I'm also picking up on, I am hearing mental illness, okay? So some of you guys could be um, studying... Uh, some of you guys have an interest or a desire, okay, to dig deeper when it comes to the concept of mental illness or when it comes to um, that area there. I'm also hearing health care, okay? I'm also hearing nutrition. So some of you guys could be teaching people about holistic living, all right, or there's a desire to. I'm also hearing platforms, okay, also elevation for my Tauruses who have their own businesses. I am picking up on an opportunity uh, and an opportunity for expansion, but it is going to take you getting out of your comfort zone and possibly um, some type of temporary collaboration, all right? I am hearing knowledge is power. So, so some of you all, you could be, I'm hearing alchemy, okay? So some of you guys, some of y'all could definitely have fire in your chart. If you're not following me on Instagram, what the fuck are you doing? At mocha underscore love underscore tarot. Get the fuck over there. It's weekly readings over there. I just did fire signs. And some of y'all could definitely have fire in your chart, all right? Um, or you could be dealing with the fire sign, okay? Um, I'm also picking up on external influence, all right? So I am picking up on if you're having relationship issues, I am picking up on some of y'all going to have to set boundaries when it comes to family and friends because people don't know how to fucking mind their motherfucking business, all right? Um, I'm also hearing some of y'all are realizing that pocket watching is at an all-time high. Be careful with how you move around a particular person, especially if this individual has fire or air in their chart. Uh, Gemini, Libra, Aquarius, um, Aries, Leo, Sagittarius. I feel like some of you all, 
Some of y'all is playing a Fisher Price ass motherfucking game with a childish ass fucking fire sign, all right? I feel like either this is how this fire sign feels about you, Taurus, or this is how you feel towards the fire sign. I feel like there's a lot of tit for tat, but nobody's really speaking their feelings. And I feel like there's an opportunity for closure as well as forgiveness, but somebody's going to have to take accountability for their actions. So therefore, in turn, whoever this is, whether it's you or another person, somebody's avoiding the whole, just throw the whole motherfucking situation away, but you feel it, okay? I'm also hearing occult knowledge, okay? So some of you guys could be studying, some of y'all could uh, be diving very uh, deeply into the occult, all right? I'm also picking up on, um, okay, some of you all could be practitioners. Some of you all are also very interested in learning about how to materialize or um, manifest using elemental magic, all right? For some of you all, I'm also seeing waist beads, okay? So some of you guys, some of y'all could be focused on, um, I'm hearing body goals. So some of you guys could be focused on um, shedding weight. I am hearing confidence, all right? For my Tauruses, I'm hearing shifts. So someone could actually be wanting to invest in a food truck or that's someone's goal. I'm also hearing um, catering business. So someone could have a catering business. I am hearing collaboration with that. Be open to delegating, uh, delegating help, okay? Delegating your task. I am hearing help is available, but again, pride comes before the file to where some of you all are needing to some of y'all are needing to compromise in a situation and not handle it so pridefully. I am hearing woman scorned, okay? So this could be with someone who could have hurt you. I am hearing abandonment. Someone could have triggered some type of abandonment issue. A lot of shadow work, all right. I'm also picking up on jury. Some of you guys could either make jury, okay, or a, a, a jury is going to be significant. Someone could also be giving. I feel like some of you all are dealing with a situation where someone gives you things and they feel like someone someone doesn't know how to communicate efficiently or someone doesn't know how to communicate effectively someone feels as if they give it someone feels as if if they give you something like somebody want to just give you something and now you just shut the fuck up and go make me a grilled cheese sandwich like who the fuck are y'all dealing with bitch if it ain't bill gates i know you fucking lying all right um huh you understand me? Y'all reading between the lines of that shit. For, uh, for, okay, so I'm also picking up on movement. Okay, so movement, all right? Movement is significant. For some of you all, this could also be expanding your business into a new city, okay? I am here in breaking grounds, okay? New territory. So for some of you all, you could be moving for a business or expanding a current business into a different city. I'm also picking up on a lot of networking, a lot of social networking, a lot of communications online, okay? Some of you guys could also be finding out something online or you could... I'm also hearing blackmail. Like some of you guys... Honey, I'm hearing extortion. Some of you all, Tauruses, be careful. Smoke by yourself, drink by yourself, mm, 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 by your goddamn self, for real, by your goddamn self, for real, by your goddamn self, all right? Because I feel like for some of you all, associations is going to be, it's going to get your ass caught up in a bad situation. Some of you all are receiving red flags. I'm hearing warning, okay, a warning and a sign, all right? Some of you all are discovering that you've been sleeping with the enemy. Taurus, I'm feeling a lot of towers, a lot of epiphanies, but I'm also picking up a lot of creative energies. For some of you all, you're not worried about none of this shit. You focus on your bag. You focus on expansion. You focus on collaborating with others. You focus on building your spiritual community is what I'm also hearing. I'm also hearing soul tribe. Some of you all are also discovering that you have some very gifted children as well. Some of your children are coming into their gift of mediumship, okay? I am hearing inherited gifts. So for some of you all, I'm also hearing acknowledging, all right, or aligning with your gifts. Some of you all feel as if your uh, situation is stagnant. But I feel like it's your ancestors blocking you because you're dealing with someone who is a taker. Someone wants you to do all the motherfucking work and they just want to sit back with their motherfucking feet up like, bitch, <laughs> Taurus got it, so we good. The fuck? Who y'all who who y'all dealing with? All right. I'm also picking up on be very careful about what it is that you sign, especially if this is some type of lease agreement, because I am here in property. I'm here in location, location, location. So this could be having to do with the location or some type of property manager around like the location of your business is what I'm hearing. For some of you all, you may have to pay some type of unexpected expense for some type of car repair, all right? Some of y'all need to okay. 
some of you all need are needing to check your fuses. Some of you all actually have some type of electrical issue that's having to do. I'm also hearing compressors. Some of you guys could have compressor issues with your car. I am picking up on a major expense or a major a major expense. I'm also hearing major purchases. Big bands, okay? Big bands. I'm also picking up investments. Some of you guys are getting into uh, learning about um, stock trades. I'm also hearing cryptocurrency, okay? For some of you all, you could also be spiritual teachers. I'm, I'm also hearing teachers. Some of you guys could also be teaching about finance, credit. Some of you all could be uh, focused on increasing your credit is what I'm hearing. I'm hearing business loan, business credit, grants and approvals. I'm also picking up on someone staying in a situation because they I'm hearing I'm hearing someone knows too much. Some of you all are going to receive a lot of revelations through your dreams in the month of March, okay? I'm also picking up on for those of you who could have recently lost someone in the month of late Jan well late January into February, baby, my condolences, honey. I send you so much love. And so much healing, all right? But for some of you all, you're getting some type of closure within your subconscious space. I am picking up on you guys learning how to set some type of psychic boundaries. Some of you all have a telepathic connection to someone who you no longer want to be connected to. I feel like someone's also astrally stalking you, all right? And some of y'all need to clean your damn mirrors, okay? Okay, let's, let's get into it. Give me a soul, uh, a soul's journey. Lesson card. Give me two for tours for the month of March. Please, Spirit. And thank you. Taurus. Someone rising Venus. And the North Node and the Cross Watchers for Taurus for the month of March, please. All right, you guys got success. I know that there is no greater goal than to love, okay? Also, you got discipline. I can accomplish what I set my mind to surrender, all right? I'm also hearing divine order, okay? So I can release my need to control at the bottom of the deck, all right? For some of you all, I am hearing inevitable, okay, inevitable ending. So for some of you all, I feel like there's a lot, there's been a lot of focus on trying to hold something together that was never meant to be held together. I'm hearing reasons and seasons. Some of y'all are discovering or acknowledging the fact that you have an issue with letting something go. I'm also hearing harbor resentment. Like some of you all got to, some of y'all have something that you need to get off your chest. I feel like there's a lot of pride due to fear of rejection. Okay. Or you don't know if somebody's going to be cool to come out of the bag on your ass. All right. You guys got discipline. I can accomplish what I set my mind to immediately with looking at this card. I hear structure, strategize, plan accordingly. For some of you all, this has to do with some type of separation, okay? Saving your damn money. Some of you all are emotionally spending on shit that you don't fucking need. I'm also hearing hoarders, okay? Someone could be a hoarder. You guys got success. I know that there is no greater goal than to love. So for some of you all who are wanting to break into entrepreneurship, some of you all who are making the, I, I, I'm seeing someone just completely shut a door, okay? So somebody can be getting the kick, kick the fuck out like, oh, Taurus. I'm also picking up on someone strategically leaving a situation. I feel like this could also, someone could also be like doing nice things for you, but I feel like someone's trying to manipulate another person into like someone's emotionally manipulative. Someone's trying to get close to you or you're trying to get close to somebody to manipulate them. That shit's going to go all fucking bad. I feel like whatever it is that is falling away, whatever it is that you are separating yourself from, it's creating space. For you to stay focused, for you to be completely focused on your purpose, okay? I'm also hearing divine wisdom, divine knowledge, cosmic consciousness. Some of you all are wanting to uh, 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 raise your, I'm, I'm sorry, some of you all are wanting to uh, raise your awareness. Elevate in consciousness, okay? Elevate your consciousness. Um, I'm also hearing tax fraud, all right? Some of y'all could be finding out that someone like could have used your... I'm hearing like I'm, I'm hearing stolen identities. Like y'all be careful with who you give your information to. I'm also picking up on whoever you be careful with. Make sure that you verify the company. Make sure that you check a company's credentials before you send your money. Because I am picking up on some scam you ill fucking Jackson type of fucking activities. All right, Taurus. 
You guys got two face friend, okay? Be careful who the fuck you tell your motherfucking business to. I feel like someone could be playing both sides. Some of y'all is dealing with a fake ass water sign, Cancer Pisces, Scorpio, okay? I'm also okay. So you guys got promotion. It's on the way. All right. For some of you all, this could also be someone at work trying to get close to you. I feel like someone wants your position or someone knows that you qual that you qualify for a position. I feel like someone's trying to sabotage something for you, Taurus, okay? Keep stay woke. Keep your motherfucking eyes open, all right? You guys got solar plexus chakra, okay? I am hearing confidence. I'm also hearing motivation, okay? Some of you all are also needing to change up what it is that you're eating because I'm getting a lot of sluggish energy. Now, for some of you all, I'm hearing that these are ascension symptoms. But for some of you all, I am hearing that through this DNA activation that you are, that you are, are going to be experiencing in the month of March, I am picking up on the energy of some of you all are like, your ass ain't 21 years old. For those of you who are 21, listen, honey. Go, I want to be like you when I fucking grow up, okay? But for those of us who is 25 plus out here, all right, I definitely pick up the energy of uh, your, your digestive system. Someone, someone could actually be having some type of digestive issues, okay? I'm also picking up on issues with the throat for some of you all. Some of y'all could actually be walking away from some type of habit, all right? Yeah, some of y'all are dealing with a toxic child's parent. I'm hearing malicious, like someone's trying to do something malicious to, to, to cause you that have some type of loss. I'm also picking up family. Okay, I'm hearing family. This could be a, a sibling as well. Or this two-faced ass friend. All right. What the fuck I tell you? I heard blackmail. All right. So for some of you all, this could be someone trying to uh, blackmail you into giving them something and providing them some type of free service or giving them some type of access to something that you have. Okay. I'm also hearing relationships. So this could even be some of you all are afraid to leave a relationship because you feel as if someone's going to blackmail you or someone's threatening to um, sabotage your business or your reputation is what I'm hearing. All right. You guys got herbal divination. Again, it takes me back to elemental magic. I am hearing with this herbal divination, okay, for some of you all, this, this could have to do with manifestations. Like some of you all are getting into herbs for holistic reasons or for like um, medi um, medicinal reasons. But I'm also hearing herbal divination. For some of you all, this could actually have to do with something that you want to teach. Some of you all are spiritual teachers and you are herbalists. Look, I take spiritual teacher, all right? Some of you all are stepping to the forefront. You're facing your fears, all right? At the bottom of the deck, we got checking to see if their magic is working. So some of you all, someone could have been, yeah, some of y'all could have been dealing with a spiritual teacher or this could, be, this could be you, Taurus, all right? But some of you all could have had someone practicing, doing some type of, practicing some type of, some type of herbal divination. I'm hearing come to me, okay? So someone could try, someone could be trying to uh, manifest another person. This could be definitely involving an air sign, Gemini, Libra, Aquarius, okay? Some of you all could have also had a fire sign. There could have been some type of energy vampire. This person is affecting your solar plexus chakra, your ability to create, all right? Manipulating paperwork. Again, be careful what it is that you're signing. Be careful with how, how, be careful to read and, and like pay attention to how things are worded. What the fuck people are saying, okay? I'm also hearing inheritance. So someone, some of y'all could be finding out that someone manipulating, manipulated some type of paperwork, which is causing some type of holdup. If you could have recently lost some type of maternal figure. Prophetic dreams. Okay, so some of you all, again, revelations through your dream space. All right. Lastly, you guys got third-party entanglements, okay? Synchronicities and confirmations, all right? So for some of you all, pay attention to the synchronicities in which you're receiving, all right? Some of you all are getting some type of synchronicity or some type of uh, confirmation possibly around somebody being a fucking cheater, all right? Some of y'all is huh, dealing with bust down Tatiana. Huh. Some of y'all is dealing with fucking toxic Tyrone, all right? Some of you all, I'm also getting dream interpretations, okay? So some of you all are dream interpreters at the bottom of the deck. You guys got telepathic connection, all right? So for some of you all, I feel like there's some, like some of you all know that someone wants to come towards you. I feel like for some of you all, something's, some of y'all could be getting into dream interpretation. This could even be what you are teaching. I'm hearing mastery, okay? All right, so we're going to pull... And see what signs are significant. Okay, this could be your chart, or this could be this could be um, placements within your chart, or this could also be someone in which you're dealing with. All right, so let's get. We're gonna pull six for Taurus. I heard six. All right, so okay, so this could be involving an Aries. Okay, 
Cancer moon at the bottom. We're going to let them fall. But Aries could be significant or you could have Aries in your chart. All right. You guys got Leo moon. You guys got Pisces moon. Cancer rising. Sagittarius. At the bottom of the deck, we got Leo. Okay. And lastly, Scorpio rising, and at the bottom, we got Scorpio moon, okay? So, this could be in your placements. Again, somebody's, yeah, some of y'all need to watch your money, man. Somebody's fucking with the church's money. Somebody fucking up the church's money, all right? Be very careful when it comes to inventory as well, especially if you own your own business. Watch your shit, all right? Because for some of y'all, I'm also hearing tools. If you are working uh, in construction or if you are working in some type of like architectural business, someone could be trying to steal your blueprint or steal your tools is what I'm hearing. Ooh, baby, stay woke. They be fucking creeping, all right? So Taurus, this is what I have for you. This will be your monthly message for the month of March. You guys come in below. Let me know how this resonates and I love you long time. Bye, my babies.